good afternoon welcome to my channel this is lighthouse please don't forget to like subscribe comment and share take what resonates leave what does not use your own intuition when interpreting these messages everything you need to know is below the video in the description box if you'd like to book a personal reading with me you can do so at my website this is lighthouse.com <clears throat> excuse me or you can uh contact me on my instagram page this is lighthouse 79 As always, I'd like to thank my ancestors, angels, my guides, the divine, for allowing me to be a clear channel. This is a weekend reading for the collective, just cause weekend money, love, finance. Let's see what comes out. Right, let's see what Guan would have. What's going on? Okay. First card out we have is true offering. May I release the fears, illusions, and addictions that keep me from true offering. May I relax into your plan, trusting that the next steps will always be shown. Use me, love. Use me for the highest. I'm yours alone. Love is unconditional love, that is. True love is the highest vibration in the universe, in the multiverse. Divine timing. The divine brings things in the timing that we need. Nothing comes before we are prepared nor leaves too early. Nothing. No thing. May I always trust your perfect and holy timing, dear Lord. I love these cards. They're so beautiful to me. Divine timing. Divine will. Divine union. Divine plan is what I just heard. Divine intervention. I know that's right. Divine direction. Divine alignment. Divine connection. Divine everything. I know that's right. Travel. Let every aspect of this trip unfold in harmony. May divine order arrange and handle every detail. I'll be guided easily and follow the leads as they are shown. Thank you for your divine providence and prudence is what I just heard. And your traveling mercy. Some people are traveling just for fun and some people are traveling for business. Other people are traveling for uh, work. Excuse me. Um, family. Somebody is um, sick, they're traveling to see a sick family member. Others are traveling for vacation. Others are traveling for work, uh, for missionary work. You know, travel. I want to travel. I want a vacation, you know. I think it's time for a vacation for everybody. And look at this. Look at the next card out. Have, f have fun. Celebrate. Don't be so serious. Play. But that's what time it is. Vacation, placation, vacation. And then I heard just Lake Placid. Anytime I hear Lake Placid, I think of um the horror movie. But, excuse me, obviously Lake Placid was around way before that time. So maybe you're traveling to Lake Placid or live in Lake Placid. And then I heard Placenta. Let me read what the book says for a play. It's time to play. It's time to heal your inner child. It's time to color, danced, danced. So maybe somebody already did dance. Um, dance with my father is what they're playing for me. Um, you know, color, play, do backflips, go. Uh, they're showing me the um, those colorful balls that we used to jump into it, like Chuck E. Cheese back in the days. They don't have those anymore, I don't believe. But, um... Yeah, do things that Sky Zone, you know, um, Dave and Buster's, I'm hearing, Discovery Zone. Do things that are going to heal the inner child color. They have adult coloring books. They even have stoner coloring books. 420 when I said that. <laughs> Spirit always divinely guides my words because I wasn't even thinking nothing about that until it came and I looked at the time. Okay, play. Have fun. Celebrate. Don't be so serious. Stop taking life so seriously. Your spirit needs to have some fun. The more you play, the more inspiration will follow. Take some time out to do something without being attached to the outcome. You are being called to rest and to play, to learn and to have more fun, to do something that makes you laugh, which is the best medicine around. Call up a friend that you can be silly with. Take your inner child on a date. Like I was just saying, heal your inner child. 
tend to your inner child. The more you switch off your mind, the more room your spirit has to whisper and guide. When we do things without being attached to the outcome, ideas, clarity, guidance, and solutions have the space to drop in. The left and right hemispheres of the brain can begin talking to each other. Make a compulsory part of your day. Make play a compulsory part of your day. Schedule it. Spend more time doing just, just, excuse me. Spend more time doing things just because you love to do them. Just because they bring you joy and light you up. If you follow what lights you up, you will light up the world without even trying. And when you are lit up, you are in spirit. And when you are in your spirit, you fall into the flow of life. And I just heard simplicity, the creator's flow. Simplicity means the creator's flow. Five, 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 as I was saying just then. How do you play? How do you, what do you do to have fun? What lights you up? If you have been working hard lately, it's time to celebrate how far you have come. All that you have achieved. Don't rush on to the next thing. Take a moment to throw a party, go on vacation, or have some fun. Travel. Take a staycation if you need to. Take some time off of work for mental health. That's okay. Work your light activation. The work your light activation for this card. Have more fun. Play more. Celebrate your achievements. That's the balance. The work-life balance. Um, they're showing me the scene in Eat, Pray, Love, which I love that movie, but um, she's in Italy, and that's the eat part. She's in Italy, and they're explaining to her how Americans have do not have an active work-life balance. We work, 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 and we don't have time to play. He was also explaining what you do is your idea of um, relaxing is turning on the TV and just, you know, zoning out in front of the TV with a bear of food and falling asleep in front of the TV. That's not playing. That sounds like subliminal messaging and subliminal programming to me. You know, that's not playing. Play. Play with your children. Tell them you need you time sometimes, you know, it's balance, balance. We all have the same 24 hours in the day. What do you, what are you going to do with it? What are you going to do with the, the time? Whew, I trust that my intuition is always leading me in the right direction. And right now your intuition is telling you to play, to rest, rejuvenate, restore, relief, release, reboot, reset. Owning my power inspires to do the same. I am not afraid to shine. I didn't come from New York to Atlanta to play around. I didn't come to play play. I came to rise up. And now, granted, I don't know anything about, I don't know, I can't say anything. I don't know much about sports. I don't watch sports unless somebody else is watching it. I just so have to happen to tune in. But... This is how I shine my light. This is one of the ways that I shine my light. God gives us all the universe, your angels, your higher power. They're infinite names for the higher power. Whatever you feel comfortable with addressing them as is what you should address them as. Now I'm standing in my power. I just heard own it, own it, own it, work it, work it. Stand in your power, shine bright like the Statue of Liberty. Shine bright like a diamond is what I just heard. Love that song. When you stand in your power, like I'm standing in mine, when you work from the heart space, you inspire others to do the same. And others that are not inspired, we can't change the world. So that's not your problem, you know? You just have to live your life for you. You can't, you can't, um, you can't uh, change the world. I mean, granted, you can change the world by starting with yourself. Be the change that you want to see. You can't look at the next person. You have to be the starting point. Excuse me. You have to be the true offering. You have to be your own true offering. The divine says we are at your service. And maybe, um, I don't know, 23? God's favorite pair of J's, like Ghetto Nun always says. I love her channel. Am I tripping or not, Tara? But um, yeah, God's favorite pair of J's. We are at your service. <laughs> Sign still delivered is yours, I heard. My wrist, my right wrist has been hurting me really bad. <laughs> right. And that's exactly what I feel like. There's a nasty knot in it right here. In here. So I don't know. And here, maybe carpal tunnel, but I don't know where it came from. All of a sudden, <laughs> it came from scratch. 
and I just heard it will scratch. I'll take her. And guess what? Look, uh, at your service came out again. Nasty knot came out again. All in. All in. I just heard, are you in or are you out? And look at the eight. Infinity. We are all in for infinity at your service. Superhero. That's exactly what we are. X-Men, baby. Superheroes out here, man. We came to break chains of poverty, sickness, illness, disease for our us and our ancestors and our bloodline. That's what we came to do. I just heard you are the weakest link. Goodbye. A lot of people don't understand that their ancestors are removing people from the bloodline, removing people out of the ancestral protection if you've been fucking other people over in your family or other people in general over. People feel that they have ancestral protection, angelic guidance all the time. No, not if you're doing the wrong thing. You do not. I don't know who told you that. Bullshit. The wrong ancestors. That's what they're saying. They do you the wrong Missy. I just heard. The wrong Missy. Smooth and easy. Nice and easy, not odd and full. <laughs> um alkaline. Nice and easy. Smooth and easy. This is what we're here to do. Smooth things out. Mm -hmm. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows everywhere. That's what we are manifesting. 38, I don't know, you're 38 years old. You you are born on uh, March 8th. You're Pisces. You're learning to fish. I don't know, 11. Maybe 38 is your apartment number. Either way. Free falling, Tom Petty. Maybe you'll be in Tom Petty, Debbie Downer, Petty Crocker. Oh my goodness. You guys have any other messages? Weekend messages, y'all? Weekend messages? Sometimes spirit gives us whole messages and sometimes they give us bits and pieces of messages. Well, here's what time it is. This is what time it is. We are all in. We have your back. It's time to play. It's time to trouble. Trouble. It's time to travel, but somebody's in trouble. I don't know. Maybe you thought you had a silver lining. Maybe you don't. Somebody's traveling baggage be gone granted this is baggage this is um you know emotional baggage get rid of it so you can fly get rid of it so you can rise up get rid of negative places persons situations toxic friends family members fake friends family members co-workers narcissists psychopaths sociopaths it's time to play and travel that's what time it is you guys have any other messages Look, this is how I know when it's time to put the deck down when they start repeating the, the messages. We are at your service. Your wish is my command. I know, that's right. I'm a genie in a bottle. Your wish is my command. Superhero, we are at your service. Abracadabra means I create as I speak. It is Hebrew or Aramaic for I create as I speak. You speak what you want into existence. Hey, you speak what you want into existence, says the universe. The universe says everything is beautiful. Everything is beautiful. Everything is happening in divine timing. Divine timing, always and in always. All right, one more card. <clears throat> Look, again, third time at your service. See? Third time at your service. At your best. You are love. You're a positive, motivating force within my life. And when I really break down the words to that, you know, at your best, you are love. Meaning at your God self, at your highest version of yourself. Realize that is. Because we're all God in the physical flesh. It's just that some people do not remember that shit. You understand what I mean? Their consciousness doesn't remember. Their soul is here to awaken them to remember. Some of us, not everybody's here on the same mission this lifetime. In any any particular lifetime, everybody's here playing a different role. Playing playing different role. They, they're asking me to pick these up anyway. So it don't make, make no sense. It don't make no sense trying to figure this out. Look at this. They're asking me to show you this. This is the back of this. These, oh, somebody's running to travel. Ganesha. I can't remember if he's Hindu, but it's a deity. Ganesha is a deity, a remover of all obstacles. 
All right, y'all. What y'all? Uh -huh. I don't know. That's right. Last night I was watching Roll Bounce and I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I love that movie. What y'all got to say this weekend, y'all? Ah, uh, no, that's right. The child came up upside down. I don't know. Maybe. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Anytime spirit tells me things, it's 15, 15. This child came up upside down. So what I'm getting, this particular message is somebody is about to find out that their child is not theirs. And maybe you, maybe they're 18. Maybe you were 18 when you had the child. Maybe for 18 years, you, I don't know. I am very sorry, but that's fucked up. I feel like it was fucked up circumstances. And I just heard switched at birth. Who the fuck was switched at birth, man? Oh, don't put this down. This head. Main female comes up and then come courthouse. So I don't know. Maybe somebody is going to court about a child that they found out was not theirs. Oh, and look what comes out about it. Comes out. So yeah, that's that's definitely what is, is going on. Somebody's going to court. Look at this. To find out and then look. Community. So I feel like maybe, oh shit, maybe the family knew about it. The community knew about it, but you didn't. And look at the confirmation. The message card comes up upside down. That means of exactly what I just said. You didn't know about it. But everybody else in the community did. That's fucked up. See, this is what I'm talking about. Getting rid of false... It doesn't matter if it's a family member. Toxic motherfuckers. People who claim to be friends, family members. You know, oh, that's my day one. That's my homegirl, my homeboy. But meanwhile, you're fucking me over, you know fucking uh, family members of mine fucking my old uh you know boyfriends or girlfriends and i'm speaking generally not just me i'm speaking to the collective this is a collective message get rid of false people toxic family members friends stealing you know like i said screwing other people that you know screwing your exes screwing the people that you they know that you was dealing with i ain't got time for the shit Screwing somebody that was your number one. That's what I just got. That's why I don't even know. I don't even want to talk about it. This is me to fuck off. Now you feel like you, because it's fucked up, man. You don't do shit like that to people that you call friends and family. Look, now you're either in physical jail, and again, this rat always reminds me of New York, where the rats are afraid of you. Rats, biggest, biggest cat sometimes. I don't know, to a nine. 209 was the cash three winning number this morning. 11. Maybe your life path number is 11. Either you're going to physical jail or you're definitely physical jail, spiritual jail, but you're def definitely in a mental prison right now. And you're concerned about it. And you should be concerned about it if you've been screwing people over, you know? It's over. Period, point blank. Somebody is either, I'm hearing military funeral, military tribunal. So somebody is either, oh, and then they show me the high honor card in this deck, which is a 25. So either you're 19 to 25 years old, you were born in 1925. Somebody made a noise outside, so that's confirmation. You've had a, a long life, you know? Message of Message comes out, but it's upside down. Messages, weekend messages for the collective, guys. Money, finance, love. What's going on? This is what I want to talk about. And and main female came out again. So, I don't know. Either you, 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 my ace boom coon, I just heard. And then I just heard another, another man is beating my time. Biggie, Lil' Kim, another. Remember, remember when you said you would lie for me? Shit. I just heard, remember when you thought I was a gift. Remember when. Hashtag, I decided. I don't know what the f what is going on. <laughs> What's going on? What's going on? This is what I want to talk about. Unexpected income, love, money, travel, play, vacation, empire, legacy. This is what I just heard. Again, somebody is either... We're being childish. Now, this time, I'm getting that they're, they're not being childish anymore. But the first time, it was somebody's finding out that their child is not theirs.
biologically there is toil and labor. And then I heard BG. Oh, oh okay. What's in? Yeah, somebody's about to get some unexpected income about finding out that their child is not theirs because I don't get a good energy this time. And I just heard somebody's been paying child support for... Okay, two stories. Somebody's about to find out they've been child, paying child support for somebody that's not theirs, but they knew about it already. But they've been in court trying to, you know, detach from that situation. You've been paying... Because your name is on the birth certificate, but you already know that the child is not biologically yours. And although you love them, you can't afford to keep paying for something that's not yours. And I, and I believe that's right. According to the law, it's not. Because once you, it depends on the state, but, you know, a lot of states have it that way. Just because your name is on the birth certificate, you're paying child support, even if you know that the child is not biologically yours. And that's fucked up. That is fucked up. So you have a choice to make. I don't know, maybe you have 15 days to make the choice. The choice is yours, black sheep. You could get with this or you could get with that. Maybe you're a wealthy man and these people, <laughs> these hoes ain't loyal is what they just started playing. Ooh, athlete, this is what I'm getting. Athlete, you're an athlete or somebody's an athlete. NBA, N, N, I'm hearing NBA, NFL. So yeah, these hoes ain't loyal. Maybe the child is eight. Maybe you have eight children. Here comes the child card again. This time is uh, maybe your child is 18. And I'm hearing divorce court. Pathway comes up. You want to know what now? What now? Now what? Now what dot com is what I just heard. Now what do you do when you find out that the child is not yours? Billy Jean is not my son. <sighs> You put the child on her, and I guess it's a her, and her mother, because I didn't mean to say her, but it slipped out. You put the child on the mother, and her mother, on a pedestal. <laughs> and I just heard, bitch, don't kill my vibe. They kill your vibe because they f you found out that you got a message of concern. The child is not yours. The kid is not my son. You have one child. You thought that second child was yours. You thought they were your great fortune. I feel like this, I don't know, this is for somebody else. The second child was a son. You thought, you know, for, for obviously, for different, different stories for different people, different strokes for different folks, you know? <laughs> right, what you're talking about, Arnold, is what they just said. Different strokes are right. Here comes the imprisonment. Either somebody's going to physical jail or getting out of physical jail, but I get that this is a mental prison based on what I've been talk talking about. You find out that the child is not yours. Do we have any good news? Lord have mercy. Gift. Or maybe you're figuring out for somebody it's, it, it's a change. And it is a gift that um, the child is not theirs. And I get that... Um, I'm hearing a uh, developmental disability. So you love the child, but secretly you are relieved that the child is not yours. You feel bad for even thinking that way. Because God know and see. Jamaicans always say God know and see. The universe knew that you couldn't manage it anymore. And that's why they stepped in to assist you because they knew your heart was pure. They knew that she was your main female. You and the daughter, the both of you. Now you're going to court because this person was false. Here, here comes the same card again about a child. They thought they were going places because you're either military, athlete, NFL, NBA, and then they're, they're um, I'm hearing golf. I don't know, Tiger Woods. Maybe you're the next new Tiger Woods, you know? Either way, they thought that you were their mill ticket. I just heard um, the golden ticket, so I don't know. Golden, we're golden children. Golden ticket, mill ticket. 
you got a message of concern, and of course, as you got the message of concern, they got the message of concern that it's motherfucking over. It's over. It's over. They're not going anywhere. They're not going on the pathway with you. And look what was underneath this. You see how these cards don't lie? I haven't even community. They thought they were going to be a part of your community. You thought you was going to be a basketball wife. And I'm hearing LA. LA County and County of Kings. Queens County, LA County, County of Queens, County of Kings. So that's Brooklyn and Queens, New York. LA County, I don't know. That could be Louisiana or actually Cali. But look at this. I haven't shuffled. They're not going anywhere because they were stealing your money, stealing your time, stealing your life away, stealing your life force. Prana, I just heard, prana. And now they're in despair. You're in despair and so are they. You're a wealthy man or wealthy woman and they thought they were going to be creeping. Hm. These hoes ain't loyal. No, they ain't. These hoes ain't loyal. Nope. Look at this. They thought they were not going to have to work anymore. But toil and labor came out because not only are you going to have to work, you're going to have to bust your fucking ass because you're going to have to repay this karma that you brought on somebody else. Jesus. Whew. Lord, mercy. Love, money, career, finances. What's going on? Wagwan. You see what I'm saying? You're not a part of the community anymore. Now you have to... You're fucking fired is what I just heard. You're fucking fired. Okay? You have a choice to make. <laughs> they said, which bird bitch is it going to be? God damn, yo. Mature man came up upside down. They weren't being mature on about it. And look, here we go. You're not going anywhere. Come up upside down. You're not going anywhere. This is this is what you can... Ex look, look at this. Expectation card came out right you expected it to be a gift that's what you expected you expected it to be a gift that you you know that you um you have got a, yourself an athlete or a, you know somebody who is of high stature high uh, high honor but now you're gonna be in poverty because you're full of shit and i'm hearing neil didn't the celebrity, I don't know why they're telling me that. Didn't that, that happen to me? I'm sure it happened to more than one celebrity, but they're showing me that particularly. Like, the first person he met was like a piece of shit. Lied about some shit. Don't get me to lying, you know? Don't get me. I'm just a messenger. All right. Angels. Romance angels. What you gotta say? Let your friends help you. Here we go with the child, children card again. Children. Your, your love life is being affected by children. Worth waiting for. I am a love worth the wait, and I have a love worth the wait. Let your friends help you very soon. I feel like it's very soon that traveling. Travel. Let your friends help you. Maybe you're going on vacation with your friend. I know, that's right. I'm ready for vacation. Release your ex. finances and career that's right a lot of people are changing their career right now or um you know doing other things to uh supplement their income is what i hear retreat it's time for vacation i've been saying that that's probably what the title is going to be it's time to play it is time to play it's time to retreat it's time to release your ex it's time for true love it's time for trust trusting yourself Trusting your decisions, trusting the universe. If you can't trust your own decisions, then you're going to have to work on that. Heal yourself. Go to see who you need to see. Pray, meditate, write things down. Journal. Gratitude journals. Vision boards. Burn your sage. Burn your incense. It's time for reconciliation. It's time to heal the inner child so you can live. Ooh, new love, past life relationship. Let me see. All of them are coming up. Look. You see? Travel, vacation, retreat, honeymoon. Some people are actually going on their honeymoon. Oh, that's right. I'm trying to go on a honeymoon. Calling in your soulmate. Hmm. 
I just heard switch. I know a lot of people um, are being repaired with another divine masculine, another divine feminine for, you know, an array of reasons. <sighs> what else y'all got to tell me? Give me one second. in my own oracle decks but guess what this is what spirit has to say she's straight like 9 15 know what i mean you already know papa coming home to give you that favorite position from the back door <laughs> don't ask no questions you already know mm -hmm. must love dogs is what i just heard ig famous Overnight celebrity, uh, over, overnight celebrity. I know that's right. Phone convos. Don't let you, the door hit you on the way out. Take a risk. Let your friends help you. Take a risk. Travel. Retreat. Release your ex. It's time to play. Look at that. Take a risk right on top. It's time to walk away from anything that doesn't serve you. It does not matter if it's a family member or a friend, that a long-time friend, a close family member. It makes it even worse, like I've been saying. If these people are friends and family members, why should they be treating you this way? Walk away. I decided that I'm not, personally, I decided I'm not taking bullshit off of nobody ever again. And that doesn't mean that I'm rude or mean to anybody else. It doesn't mean that at all. It doesn't mean that I'm angry. It means I'm healed. I'm balanced. I'm whole. I'm centered. But people get it twisted. I just heard how you want to pull my whole card, but you the whole. People get it twisted when you tell them that you're a spiritual person. Spiritual person doesn't mean all positive all the time. Spirituality. <clears throat> <clears throat> that was definitely the ancestors because my voice started getting loud and then I had to clear my throat. Spirituality encompasses negative and positive. Negative and positive. People, some people are actually having hallucinations because you're in spiritual jail. And I just heard doppy, doppy. And I also heard nine night. So West Indians know what I'm talking about. Having hallucinations. Some people are having hallucinations again because they're being terrorized by uh, other people's ancestors. You've been um, screwing with other people, screwing with just, you know, screwing with things that you don't have no business screwing with. I was just listening to um, a reader was talking about somebody digging up uh, dirt at a grave site. That, yeah. And look at that. Somebody, somebody is doing this shit because guess what? When you listen to other readers, just like you listen to me, it should be a confirmation of what you already know. Sometimes, you know, we don't know everything. Anybody who claims to know any, everything, you need to be running as far away from them as you can. Nobody, only fools know everything. Wise men know that they don't know everything. Only fools know everything. Only fools. I can do that. Yeah, you can do that. You're a magician. Some people hate their children. Again, I don't know what's going on, but you know your story. Heal what you need to heal. Get rid of who you need to get rid of. Again, it doesn't matter if it's a child, parent. If they're fucking you over, if they're not doing the right thing by you, then get rid of them. Period. Point blank. Surprise visit. Like I said, some people want to surprise. I don't like surprise visits. You need to communicate with me. Contact me. And let me give you the okay before you come surprising anybody. I don't like that shit. I don't like that shit. I don't like that shit. <laughs> they show me that scene in... Um, Belly. I don't like that shit with Tyrone Turner and Belly with his big old glasses. So I don't know. Maybe you got Coke bottle glasses. Maybe you got a Coke bottle shape. Or maybe you got, just got big old thick glasses. Or maybe you doing your hair in a flip. I used to do my hair in a flip like that in the 90s. <laughs> and now the flip is back back in again. I took my braids out. I got the fro back. I let the fro go. And that's all I'm going to show today. This is what I've been doing, self-loving myself, caring for myself, meditating, journaling, getting on YouTube, spreading my message, uh, minding my business. I just heard Dr. Pepper paying my ancestral debt in full, paying my karma, healing my ancestral karma, healing my own karma, paying my ancestral debt in full, centering myself, grounding myself, 
Let's meet up for drinks. Yes, let's. And here's the confirmation. Let's. Rapid 111 means rapid and uh, rapid, uh, fast and rapid manifestation. Look up any angel numbers you see. Look up repeating numbers. Buy repeating numbers. Lotto. Um, a lot of people are seeing repeating numbers on tags. A lot of people doing um, uh, candle gazing, sun gazing, um, opening their third eye. Again, like when you when you're opening your th while you're opening your third eye and being moved to tell you, look up your fourth eye. Four eyes. That's what spirit calls me. Four eyes. All four of my eyes are open. Creator, you are a creator. You are co-creating with the universe. You are creating the reality that you see. We're not taught that, you know. Somebody applied for a job and they got the job. Yay! Congratulations. Unions, union is here. Some people are going into union. Some people are at Union Square, Fourteenth Street, Street, <laughs> Street. So maybe somebody's um, having shish kebabs on a skewer. So maybe that's where Street. Screed came from, or somebody's being discreet, or not, or maybe you are, you are being discreet. Other people are in despair because you're living your life for you. That's your, not your problem, excuse me, that's a personal problem. You're problem solving and they are not. You're right. Somebody's mouth is right in X. There you go. Somebody's ex. Somebody's ex is not writing a... <clears throat> Somebody's ex is writing checks that they, you know, they can't cash. Their mouth is writing checks they can't cash. And maybe their name begins with X or yours does. And I heard Xavier. Exodus. Movement of Ja people. Maybe your name is Exodus. You are a great mom. You are a great dad. And you're trying better and better every day. I know. I know I wasn't the greatest parent. I know I was angry and bitter. And I know there was a lot going on with me throughout the years. And I realized that I had to change myself. I always check myself. Check yourself before you wreck yourself. When you're so high up on whatever the fuck ladder you will put yourself on, your own pedestal that you can't hear, <laughs> they, they're telling me, nah, it's, um, what, them old timers advise you this to some problems that's ahead. Drama with the feds not listening, just bobbing your head. Yeah, when you're so high up on your own pedestal that you can't listen to advice, you can't listen to your intuition, the ancestors say, you're going to make me lose my mind, man. Again, ex exodus. You need to do what you have to do for you. You already know. Mm -hmm. Shit straight like 915, know what I mean? Look at this. Are you down? I want to fuck you. Are you still down? I don't know. Who is this? Who is this? Who wants to fuck you? <laughs> <laughs> when we gonna fuck Miss Parker? Catch feelings, not flights. You know what I'm saying? Some people want to catch feelings, not flights. And uh, those of us that are sending want to catch flights, not feelings. Despair, because there's a karmic baby. And then I heard the baby's not even yours. Karmic baby still, but not yours. You manifested it. Yes, you did. You manifested whatever you have in your reality, good, bad, ugly, and everything in between. You manifested by thought, word, deed, action. By his deeds shall a man be known, is what they're just telling me now. 333, three, three, you are creator. You are creating the reality of your dreams. Or not. You might be creating a nightmare, but it's you. You're doing it. Nobody else is doing it. We have grace and mercy. We have peace and understanding. Whatever you call forth is what you experience into your reality. Great mom is coming up again. Uh, prayed up. Great health. Yeah. Healthy boundaries. Grace. Mercy. Great health. You know what I'm saying? Look, crown chakra activations. Some people have baby mama drama, baby daddy drama, and getting rid of it. Getting rid of it. It's my time now. Yeah, it is. It's my time now. It's your time now. I never want to be without you. Excuse me, miss. Secret admirer. Your secret admirer has healthy boundaries. It's safe to love. Your secret admirer is prayed up. 
your secret admirer is a great mom, great dad, great parent. And maybe they got the job and got, got the job as you. You're the job. You're the mission. <laughs> I just heard Jagged Edge, you're my mission. Got my mind in the trance and my body sure to follow. I know that's right. Woo! I know that's right. <laughs> oh, I know that's right. I'll be waiting for you, man. How far are you willing to take this? How far are you willing to take this? <laughs> Okay, that's how far we will to take this nightcaps. <laughs> oh, yes. Look, look, look. Lingerie, look, look. <laughs> okay, okay. That's that's what we talking about. Okay, pray up. Okay, okay. <laughs> right, and look. You see me doing this? We on vacation. God damn it. We're on vacation of swatting away these mosquitoes on vacation and these gnats. So I don't know. Own that. Maybe you're on own that. Maybe you live on own that. Maybe you're on own that. Maybe your name is Natalie. See? The ancestors say it's, it, it's we have infinite possibilities out here. Okay? I want somebody, peace. The peace that surpasses all understanding. Yes. Let go of anything that doesn't serve you anymore. Okay? Heal. Heal the past. You are thankful. You are trusting the universe. You are grateful. You are concerned, but not worried. And anybody should be concerned. Again, check yourself. Superficial, but it came up upside down. No, you are true. You are authentic. You are true to yourself. Lingerie comes out again. How funny. <laughs> oh my God, some people have drug and alcohol problems. Some people took bad advice. Some people are bad influences. I don't know now. Well, get clear. Get clear so the universe can get clear on what to bring you. When you are not clear, the universe is not clear. Sound off and grow up here. Okay? Get clear. Grow up here. Get clear. Do you want to come to my place? Oh, yeah. For sexy lingerie, hot sex on a platter. <clears throat> licking, moaning, sucking with my divine counterpart, with my true friend that is plotting for our vacation. Somebody, single parent, superficial came up this way this time. Anything else? Grateful. Healing the inner child. Grateful. Brother. Brother. Spying came up. So somebody's brother spying or you're spying on your brother. Mm -hmm. I'm expecting the unexpected. I'm going with the flow. Let's watch a movie together. Let's have a nightcap. Kiss it better. Kiss it better. Mm hmm. Yup. Anything else? Anything else? Somebody works in a prison or jail. Don't, don't, don't shit where you sleep. I feel that you guys work. I heard CO, PO. So maybe one's a CO, one's a PO. Or you're both COs or both POs. Either way, don't do it. Do not do it. And this is why. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Do not. Do not do it. You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Do not do it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Don't do it. You better talk to Pamela. So my, somebody's wrist is hurting because they've been, you know, doing what they need to do. Heighten intuition and perception. Keep your sexually transmitted demons to yourself. I've been, um, I'm not going to blast my business, but, uh, there's a lot of people celibate right now. Myself included. You know what I mean? Myself included because I'm not playing. Y'all can keep your goddamn demons to yourself. It's not because I haven't wanted to. Of course we want to. We're humans, you know. We're we're we're, we're grown. We have needs. But guess what? I'm not playing. Oh, yeah. It's just a spiritual war, okay? Heal the inner child. Okay? Be close with yourself. Love yourself. Everybody is being manifested, their new beginning. Don't worry about it. There's a lot of things I don't have myself that I would like to manifest. I'm not perfect. None of us are. Four, 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 four. But guess what? New homes, new cars, new uh, families, new co-workers, new places of worship, 
no apartments, no clothes, no templates, no grids, no consciousness, no information, no light workers. But that's what we're manifesting. We're manifesting miracles and magic. Okay? Anything else, guys? Baby daddy issues, misogynist, doesn't have a car, older woman, knowledge of self. Anything else? See? This is what we're trying to achieve. Okay? You can only achieve heaven on earth when you heal that inner child. Let, let go of anything, anybody that hurt you. See, that person is not your friend. She's not your friend, that girl. I see her watching me. She's licking her legs at me. She's not your friend, that girl. Somebody gonna catch a fucking case, I just heard. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. It's time for us to receive rewards. Okay? That's what time it is. Somebody's spying. Our ancestral debt is paid in full. We have uh, taken care of ourselves. Joy. Yep. Mm hmm. And that's okay. That's okay. I'm hearing Seven Streeter. That is okay. We're prayed up. We're joyful. Yes, it's okay to be a stoner. Don't drink as much, they're telling me to tell y'all. If you want to, you know, get a little bit, get a little high, smoke a little pot. Smoke a little reefer. Smoke a little, you know, sensimenia. Smoke a little ganja. Smoke a little MJ, but lay off the liquor, man. Them spirits, they call spirits spirits because of, of that. <clears throat> That's why when you yeah take a risk, lay off the uh, lay off the liquor. They said. Take a risk, and lay it off. Lay off the liquor. You already know. Burn sage. Go ground yourself. Smoke some weed. Music meditation as therapy. Contact your true friends. Call in your soulmate. Call in your divine counterpart. Who is high vibing? Manifested this vacation. Somebody has several baby mamas and need more time. I love you. Are you still down? Somebody regrets what they did. Foreplay. Stop playing. You was the one playing, is what I just heard. I am watching you. Baby daddy issues, misogynist, one month, no, rebirth, transformation and rebirth come upside down. What the fuck you gonna do about it in despair? Problem solving. Some people in despair, some people are spying and some people are, again, going on vacation. Anything else, guys, anything else. Teenager comes up upside down. Heal the child. Your inner child is a teenager. Some of us. 17 again. I want to fuck you, lingerie. I got the job. Writes erotic stories. Please don't deny me, says your ego. Excuse me, says your um, says your uh, your soul. We are divinely guided right now. Some of us are in separation from, look at this, separation from fake friends, toxic family members, fake mothers, fathers, sisters, brothers, cousins, aunts, uncles, <clears throat> doesn't matter. We're paid in full. That person is not your friend. Again, toxic family members and friends and co-workers heal the inner child so we can have rich sex. You can be close with your inner child. You can be close with your partner. You can have knowledge of self. x reactive. That's right. I'm feeling freaky. You see what I'm saying? It's time for vacation. You wouldn't believe me if I told you, man. You won't believe me if I told you. We're going to leave it at that. Thank you so much, angels and ancestors. Thank you for listening to this video. That has been your reading. If you'd like to contact me, you can do so at uh, lissislighthouse.com. <laughs> Somebody wrote, look, I would do anything for love, but I won't do that. Well, you don't have to contact me if you don't want to, but if you'd like to do a reading, if you'd like to contact me for a reading, you can book one uh, at my website, lissislighthouse.com, or contact me at... This is Lighthouse 79 on my Instagram page. Thank you so much. See you guys next time. Be well.